Hi people and welcome back for another story from KRN News, bringing you the most exciting stories from around the world. This episode takes us to the United Arab Emirates, where at the start of February 2020, authorities arrested the suspected leader of the Bulgarian Mafia, Vasil Boskov. The arrest came just days after charges were brought against him in his homeland for leading a criminal group, extortion and attempted bribery. Interpol had also put a red notice on the billionaire prior to his arrest. The charges relate to Bulgarian's national lottery, the biggest in the Eastern European country and which Boskov is the owner. Boskov, nicknamed The Skull, is alleged to have avoided 315 million euros in taxes and licensing fees dating back to 2014. Bulgarian authorities raided the head offices of the national lottery last week as well as other properties connected with the fraud. They also arrested over a dozen people with the current and previous regulators for the Bulgarian lotteries amongst them. Bulgarian parliament also responded quickly in voting to abolish private lotteries and revoke the national lotteries license. Bulgaria is one of the EU's poorest countries and mafia influence is rife within the state's institutions. However, pressure from the EU to combat organised crime is clearly having an effect as lawmakers make reforms. Charges against Boskov would have been unthinkable in previous years, with the tycoon considered untouchable. A two 2009 US diplomatic report leaked by WikiLeaks described Boskov as Bulgaria's most infamous gangster who had a hand in money laundering, privatization fraud, intimidation, extortion, racketeering and illegal antique dealing. Boskov's rise to prominence first began in 1993 when he established a casino and gambling group alongside Ilya Pavlov who was the suspected leader of the Bulgarian Mafia at the time. Pavlov was assassinated in 2004. The killing remains unsolved. Today, Boskov is one of Bulgaria's richest men with an estimated fortune of $1.5 billion. Strangely, the Thursday prior to his arrest, Boskov emailed Bloomberg stating, Until a court decision, none of the completely random charges against me are proven. He also called in on a live Bulgarian TV show, BTV, to announce that, Everything is paid for in adherence with the law. UAE doesn't have an extradition treaty with Bulgaria, so it's unclear what will happen. Only time will tell. I hope you enjoyed this story and please stay tuned for upcoming videos. And please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.